Your thoughts on uh, what you saw from DeAndre and somebody that, in theory, you'll be seeing a lot of over the coming years? Uh, I like his game a lot. Um, I really like uh, the system that he's in. He can shoot it. Uh, I think his coach will put him in great positions to be successful. And he got some veterans around that's going to teach him ropes with, T uh, with Tyson and Trevor. And, um, you know, so I feel like he's in a good position. Where would you put Coach Kerr's ejection tonight among top moments? Top five, top five, <laughs> for sure. <laughs> It seemed that you and Jordan Bell were, were talking quite a bit as you, as you were as you were going up now. For how much do you think in, he's improved, and in what areas has he improved from last year? Uh, I just think that experience helped him out. Coming into his second year, you just get a little bit more comfortable, especially as uh, uh, much, much success we had as a team, and uh, you know, him being a huge part of that. Um, just more comfortable coming in the second year, and, you know, but still learning at the same time. As a team, what, do you, what can you guys do better to control your emotions, or is that something you don't really think about? I mean, would you control your emotions out there after you've just seen what happened? <laughs> okay. <laughs> did, it, did it help you guys when, when Coach Kirk kind of went out there? And no, it didn't. I mean, it didn't, it, didn't I mean, it didn't really matter, to be honest. Uh, the ref called a lot of, a lot of uh, offensive fouls, and uh, that last one he called was, uh, I think that got us all uh, riled up right there. And uh, But... Happens as part of the game. There was any part of Steve's objection entertaining um, or amusing or no? I mean, maybe for the fans and for you guys, but no, it's pretty normal. Yeah. <laughs> He's upset at a call. Did it a preseason game? Huh? Did it a preseason? <laughs> it's still basketball, no matter if you're counting or not, right? Did a boogie tell you what he said on the air about your shoes? Yeah, man. <laughs> I ain't gonna tell y'all what Boogie said to me in the locker room about my shoes. So he got a contract he just signed, so I let him make it on that. That's it. Take the high road. Take the high road. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna take it.